raining outside, my hair's a puffy mess, and we're making personal pizzas! So we're just making personal pizzas with some non-branded flatbreads. Open up these oh. flatbreads. Oh, there's two in each one. They're so soft. Well, how many do you think we're gonna make? Um, I don't know. Do you think one of these is enough for you? One of them is enough for me. How much? How, what do you think? It's probably enough. Okay. So, we'll just pretend I did not open that. Spoonful of sauce makes the pizza. Oh yeah. Now that the trick here is not too much sauce. I like those Lunchables. <laughs> I was literally just thinking, I was like, wow, we are making We're making adult, giant Lunchables. We're making adult Lunchables. This like, is what I've been training my whole life for. I feel like I should be spreading the sauce with a giant red stick. I should probably put on the pepperoni before the cheese, huh? If that's what you're into. I don't know, I feel like that's just what you do. But then the pepperoni is like hiding. Yeah, exactly. That's how pepperoni is supposed to be, isn't it? I don't, I don't know. know. I feel that feels right to me. Do you have scissors or a knife or something? Um. Maybe I'll yeah. just open this package with my rippling guns. Yeah, you should do that. Oh my gosh, I got it. I feel so good. <laughs> you're just so strong. I feel so validated in my strength training, which includes opening sauce jars. <laughs> you need to apply Gentle. Sigmund's rule of Pythagorean theorems here when you're <laughs> applying pepperoni. <laughs> I just combined the two fields Sig of science. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you call them Sigmund. What's his real name? Freud? That's his first name, right? Sigmund Freud? Well, yeah, but people never call him Sigmund. Well, what was Pythagoras' last name? Pythag exactly! I thought that was his last name. Well, what's his first name? I don't know. Jo Josh. George. <laughs> George. George's theory. George Pythagoras. Okay, well... I like cheese on pizza. I'm that makes me unique. Cheese on. I am a special snowflake because I like cheese. I'm using a Gaussian blur effect here on my on my cheese. Is that a thing? I feel like that's a thing. It's that's totally a, a thing. Yeah, I did I did the photos. Adobe sponsors this pizza. Approved making. by Adobe. <laughs> pizza CS6. <laughs> Yours for the low low cost of twelve hundred dollars, <laughs> or for the low low cost of two hours on a torrent website. Two hours. Stop all your downloading. <laughs> Don't steal the software from the internet. Would you download a car, Steven? Yes. <laughs> In a heartbeat, I would download a car. <laughs> I mean, let's be real. Would it come out? What, where, where, how would I get it out of my computer? Just download it. 3D print the car? 3D print the car. Um, I don't know how to do this. That looks great. Okay. That looks fantastic. That looks great. <laughs> it's getting brownie points. I don't like pepperoni. I know, that's why you're weird. That's why you hate America. <laughs> Is that also because I don't like Doritos? Yeah, this, she doesn't like Doritos. I literally could have baked it and started eating by now. <laughs> I just have to make sure it's perfect. So we're gonna put this in the oven for like what, like five, six minutes? But that's gonna take so long. Yeah, maybe, but wait for it. Movie magic. Look pretty tasty. And, since I failed to do dishes this week, we have one plate for the both of us. So those are our rainy day pita personal pizzas. Pizza personal pita... I, blah, blah. Pizzas. Pizzas. Those are, those are our pizzas, because they're pita pizzas. So thank you for bearing with us as we stumbled around the kitchen and made these little tiny pizzas. Be sure to click on the subscribe button wherever it may be. Give a thumbs up, give a comment. And have yourself a delicious pizza. What do you guys like to cook? Leave it below in the comments. I'm rambling now. Okay, goodbye.